Alright guys, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. Uh, so now we're going into uh, the, the kid's schoolhouse or something. Because I think this had something to do with something. Okay. Well, I did my best. But it didn't succeed. There's an open book here. Obviously, we're just going to take everything that isn't fucking nailed down to the floor. Uh, oh, a lot of people are absent today. All absent. Hmm. It's been a while since any new students were registered here. Can you just get rid of this thing? Not Thank that you. this comes as any surprise. Just look at the place. I've had just about enough of. Oh, hey, Beryl. This place is already overrun with addicts and orphans, and now I've got to deal with what? A candied salamander? Oh. The woman shakes her head and sighs. I should stop caring so much, but the kids shouldn't suffer. They don't deserve this void-infested hellhole we're handing to them. Lay your hand on her shoulder. You imagine things are tough in arcs. She swats your hand away with a harumph. Tough, yes. And they don't get any better if I talk about things I'd rather forget. Constitution, sit on up to her. Yeah, real close. She could trust a little old you. Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to talk about things a little. This place, it used to be a school. My husband Griff and I, we taught the local kids what we could. History, politics, writing, reading. A little cooking, a little alchemy. The parents paid what they could. It was enough. Now it's... it's this. I'm stuck scrubbing Lady Kem's filthy floors in exchange for coin most days. And I don't have the energy to shoo away the junkies that wander in. Uh... Ask if she'd like those addicts to take a hike. I've tried chewing them off, but to no avail. I swear, if Griff were here, he'd have this place cleaned up in no time. If the squatters were gone, I could start fresh. Scour the place down, get the school going again. Get out from under Lady Kem's posh thumb. Run your finger across your weapon. That's a problem you could take care of for sure. No, no, I don't cotton to violence. There are other ways. I'm sure you'll find one. Beryl hums a few random notes, just a few. But in those notes, you discern a crumb of hope. Alright, we gotta get rid of some squatters, eh? Okay. Where are the squatters at? I didn't know. I guess they're over here somewhere. That's what actually says Sister Sasori. There's some people around here. That fuck sisters. <laughs> Look at the physics of that. Oh, yeah, that's beautiful! <laughs> it was just together, right? There's nothing I could do. It's something I would make. Oh, man. It must be well, death block influenced. Schools out, I dare say. Sister Siskoria, right over the fuck. Look over there. Shiny light. Do you see them? The mist steps. Each one is an echo of Lucian's dreams. Pray be his. They lead through the silver puffs and into the hall. She bows towards nothing in particular and fingers the collar of her priestly garb, then looks at you with dark, sunken eyes. Uh, note her unusual behavior. It must be quite the trip she's having. I am blessed, Red Sunburst, by Drudene and Divinity. I glide on Lucian's breath and feed on his sighs and smiles. For him, I would walk the path of blood. He needs only sing the command. I'm not like the Cat Lord, a Hulu. He slinks around and under and over and inside. He would skim the path and miss the blood. Our Hulu. <laughs> She's referencing Arhu from first game. The priest raises her head and screams to the ceiling. Lucian! My wings are ready. I will flap and flit flop when your words go blue. Our Hulu does not deserve your warm. I will ask about the uh, our Hulu. I hear he avoids Lucian's tough maker, the path of blood. He is a defiler of Lucian's will, shine beast. The crypt waits for only divine, devout, devoted. It is not an easy make trial. Bypass the blood and Lucian brings the rumble. Skyquakes across the heavens, what Lucian said. Punishment for the easy walk. 
The priest waves her arms through the air, drawing your attention to these non-existent skyquakes. She away the, the doped priest. She's not welcome here. She traces a circle on the floor with her left foot, then shakes her head. You're stymied by the foot gesture, but the head shake is more than clear. I'm going to try the hero one. Stand straight and tall, though she may hear Lucian's words, she must depart. I, yes. Your voice. His voice. It makes the air drops quiver. I am called to the cathedral. I will travel there anon. Clouds should twinkle as Lucian commanded them. Come, fireflies. He calls us elsewhere. All right, what's this fucking... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, they're all going. Oh. Um, see ya. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> they had places to be. Yeah. Yeah, they, they fucking did. All right, I'm going to go tell her that we did her thing. What was I talk about Aru? They were to uh, our Halu, but it's Aru, I think, uh, that she's referencing. <clears throat> All right, hey, we did your shit. So, how's the addict eviction going? Tell her the addicts are gone and not a drop of blood was spilled in the process. Is that... wait, really? They're gone? That's good news. Maybe our hard work wasn't all for nothing, then. Is there anything I can do to show my thanks? <laughs> well, we don't really need money, so maybe I'll just say, uh... We really want information. What can she, what can she tell you about the chems? She pauses and tightens her lips. A moment passes, and then another. She smiles. Well, at the risk of saying something I shouldn't, that whole mansion is weird. She sits in that drawing room serving tea all day. As for him, well, he doesn't even sleep in the same room as his wife. He has his own bedroom, does Kem, and it's always locked. He's got secrets, you see. Trap doors and ladders. Where they lead, I don't know. But his wife knows nothing about them. Anyway, you've certainly been a breath of fresh air. You're no Griff, but it's been good having you around. All right, so she told us to explore more of the mansion, basically. Also, these uh, these rewards are fucking dog shit, so... Good. I will just take the thing that sells for the most. Like, literally, it was like a white belt. Like, that's how bad it was. Here, you can have that. You can also have this. All right. Uh, no, home encumbered. Over encumbered. Side story. Ah, oh, there's a lizard kid. Lizard kid citizen. Ah, uh, my people. You, this place had it coming, Ken. They brought the void upon themselves. All right. No actual smoke. Oh, you know they had it that. coming. No, nah, there's no smoke in dialogue for that. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, Slip a witch to mop it on the beach. Yeah, yeah, let's go down there. You need some uh, source jizz or no? No, I'm good. Yeah, okay. I'm well fed. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, alright. Looks like there isn't really anything here, actually. We still haven't been here, so it's still, like, worth exploring. What's deal with this place? Huh. There is lots to explore, though, because we kind of we kind of totally missed this place here too. But yeah, I, generally speaking, we were supposed to find like a sewer somewhere there. We're looking for the thieves' guild, right? Yeah, because they apparently ha may have the painting. Now, if you ask me why I'm here, I don't really know the answer to that. Let's see what's over here. Nothing. Okay. I've gotten myself into the strangest spot. I won't lie. Well, at least I can jump over this. Ah, whatever. I'll just come back to you. There was nothing that way, really. And I, I assume you went the other way? It was like a bloody corpse, about it. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, this is this, but what's that? What's... what? Pink it again? It's up here, it's like a cell door. Oh, yeah. I didn't actually see that before. Oh, yeah, good eye. 
Yeah, we can we can make it there actually. Yeah, fuck it, we're here, right? Let's, let's go look it up. Yeah, I totally didn't well, see that look actually. Look, look at it. Well, I mean, there, there's a house. There's a house to go into to get there. Actually, that's we were in that house before. We just didn't do it all the way, but that's it's okay. also lo it's also bad to go in there. It's evil. Yeah, well, I'm I'm evil. Where's Red Prince? Oh, there he is. All right. Hello. All right. Well, let's open her up. Gotta go down there. All right. You need, to you need my skillful. I, I need dwarf to do this. All right, let's go. I was wondering if you had to give a dwarf a thief. Oh sure. fuck! It's horrible. It's a cellar. You're not welcome here. Ignore the warning and ready your weapons. Uh. Oh, it's a debt collector's place. Uh, what do you want to do? Well, actually, you know what? Uh, Sabiel can't do anything. Or debt collect collectors. Is there anything in here? It's the chest. Uh, okay, I'd get the chest then or something. I, I don't really see anything else here, so maybe it's not worth it for me to... Uh, Let's see what happens when I teleport the chest over here. <laughs> if you secure alone with blood, Let's take it. Oh, shit, armor. Nice. That's money and a rain scroll. Good, I was running out. There's another chest over there, but... <laughs> I can get that one too. I don't know if there's anything else here. Does it? Does it? I, I, as I said, my camera's locked right now, so does it look like there's anything else interesting here? Not really. Okay. I don't just think. No, oh, no, I went too oh, far. Okay. I was out of range for the chest. We'll just leave. If you don't want to kill them. Oh, the demons! Are they actually? Oh yeah. Not this again. <laughs> Lesser demon. I mean, we were sworn with Jahan to fucking eliminate all the demons. I don't know, do we want to keep? Right, I, I didn't think they would aggro if I went a bit ahead of you. Yeah, I guess I guess we can we can run away. Oh, we can just kill them. Nah, we'll just run away. It's fine. I mean, they are demons. Let's kill them. Well, what demons didn't do anything to me ever? No. I mean, they have been annoying us every step of the way. But, well, you've been annoying me every step of the way. Yeah, I don't kill you, motherfucker. All right, anyways, uh, you just just leave there. I, I don't know if it has some purpose uh, a little bit later. That's that's the only reason I don't want to do that necessarily. I'm gonna see if I can go find a better entrance. That's that's what we were mainly after is to find an entrance, not to fight some random ass demons. So basically, just don't get distracted. Think video game right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh wait, I think we've already been in that entrance actually for the thieves guild. I I think I know where it was talking about for the sewers. We probably did find it before. Because we were here at one point. No, oh, it's your call, boss. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure we found this earlier. Yeah, I think it was the Dwarf Thief, Thieves Guild. This may have been the place it was trying to describe to me. This down here? Yeah, we were we were here earlier. Fuck. Oh, this is the prison. The only other thing I can think of is, is that place with the ogres, wasn't there? What place with the ogres? The kids and the ogres. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're right, actually. Yeah. This is prison as well. There you go. Yeah, you're right here. That's actually a good point. I forgot about that one. That's like the, that's the only thing I can think of. I'm gonna go see what this is. Yeah. Okay, I, I had forgotten what that place was. That at least outside. Okay, it's, a, it's the other way. I will go there before I start looking things up. Again, to see, because, like, I'm just confused on where the, the painting is, but yeah. But they weren't dwarves, though, that's the only thing. But maybe they have it, who knows. Well, that's not the only thing I can think of that is remotely related. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, maybe this is it. Unusual painting, it's right here. I think that's it, actually. Uh, I mean, we could just steal from them. Got any more money? Uh, remark on their rather unique looking painting. Don't mention that it's the second pass from Lucian, and yeah, it is. Yeah, it's alright. <coughs> uh, offer to buy it? Let me think. No. Uh, where did she get it? That's for me to know, and you to never find out. Tell her you want to hear the story, you bet it's really fun. I stole it from Lord Kem's house, didn't I? And so what? I only took one of them. The other two were too heavy. Oh, so it is these guys. It wasn't a dwarf. Okay, uh... Ask where exactly. Got a map. There's a poly thing here. And then a pool with no water and a hatch in it. Easy. By the painting? Yeah. No. Uh... Tyler's too childish for you anyways. Okay. You can have it for... <coughs> this much. 10,000? I don't think we can afford that. I mean, we can, but... <laughs> You're poor. What the fuck? She just called me poor. Hey everyone, this place discriminates <laughs> discriminates, uh, discriminates against the poor. Alright, just steal it. <laughs> just steal it? Yeah, just doing this? Yeah, fuck these guys. Just like, uh, uh, you know. You know, you know, you know the strategy. Here, one sec. Yeah. I'm gonna talk to this person. Hello? Having f Keep faced the wrong money. direction. Oh wait, we all have it to talk to her? To everyone. Keep your hands off us. Alright. One sec. I trusted you. Yeah, okay. Fight. Easiest game of our lives. And then just teleport to outside. <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah, let me let me fucking figure out where you where you went. I just went to the building. I just went anywhere because I didn't want to stay there. Oh, okay. You know, Easy already, game, man. Easy game. Easy life. Let's go back to Cam's mansion and steal his shit. Cam's gardens. Yeah. Uh, where was that? Oh, here it is. I found it. Easiest game of my life, boys. Let's go do this. Hey, just fly there, you bitch. <laughs> You're just jealous. Alright, sneaking mission. Fuck. Fuck, there's so many of them. God, the rock has wings! You need to sneak more often, Mike. That was amazing. <laughs> All right, you were okay. totally inconspicuous. Yeah, no, they didn't see me. The spirit of a painting hovers where the painting itself once stood. Well, uh, you have it, so you have to put it in. Uh, or something. Complete the triptych. Return the real sick, second passion of Lucian to the right place. Oh shit! It's happening. Gold pile, gold. What's wow. this? I found something. Uh, locked. Well, let me waste a lockpick on it. Yep. There's more lock stuff here. Lucky find. Uh, so I guess you couldn't open it? Could not open it. Now I'm just gonna try the things. Well, try, it's breaks the bill now, maybe. Have a walk around and sniff things. I mean... Red Prince found that door in the first place. What, what is even in there? It's just a small hovel. See, Revola Intelligence Armor. Plus two summoning, holy shit, that's amazing. Uh, here's a grenade for Ethan. E fam. That is actually legitimately amazing. Plus two summoning. That's it's an upgrade. But we did not find a scroll yet. I mean I found a shadow infusion skill book. Yeah, we're freezing arrow. <laughs> it's a chemical carry. warfare grenade. I'll be over in combat. Hey, pick it up, idiot. Look at the books though. Uh, nice. I don't think there's Living on the edge skill book. So there's two torches here. 
So what 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 happens? It's just a, it's just that the oh here we go. I got it. There's a book. I think there's something. Oh shit. The you have to go deeper. Of Lord Cal Kim. The sign here. A dagger of pain shoots through your head, halting your advance instantly. You hear a voice, soft and calm, yet laced with disappointment. Such a long journey you have undertaken in the service of thieving charlatans, in pursuit of that which you will never obtain. A long, sad sigh reaches you from the depths of the void itself. <sighs> this is your last chance. Abandon this folly. Leave and never return. Did man to know who you're speaking to? I am the past. I will be the future. I am the God King. You are but a misguided servant. Heed my words and leave. I do not wish you harm unless you force my hand. Wonder why the God King has a shrine in such a place. Because my followers are many. My followers are everywhere. Your endeavors are pointless. The voice fades away, and with it, the pain. Nice. Only the God King knows the weight of responsibility. Ah, uh, that's basically it. He has a giant fucking vault down here. Did we find the need to find? A, did we find the thing we need to find? We didn't find anything. There's nothing down here. Well, there was a shield which I'm not using. Oh, okay. Is it a good shield? Only the God it's actually really good. Knows the weight of responsibility. I have deflecting permanently. Oh, good. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. Well, also, it has a rune slot, so you have a spare physical rune? Uh, I probably do. Yeah. Here, I'll just, a I'll good just, one? I'll just give you red prints and you just decide. Go. I mean, large, it's good enough, I guess. Was this, this kind of a weapon? Nope. Good enough for me. Well, I don't think there's anything else down here, so... Alright. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take Red Prince back. Okay. I don't think there's anything There's gotta be something there. with this tone, with this altar, though. Like, I'd put something on the altar, probably. Cursed Only Oil the Barrel. God King knows the weight of responsibility. <clears throat> the weight of responsibility? Oh, I, th I think I have the solution to this puzzle. <laughs> I had a feeling! What? Alright, I was just beaming. I was just beaming. <laughs> Gonna go down there? <laughs> I put death fog crate on it and it fucking opens. Oh, okay, this is, this is worth a save. Ahu! Oh, what, is it? Oh, yeah, it, is, it actually is. Fear not, Ahu, I am coming. There's someone here. He seems to be in great pain. The man before you writhes in pain, oblivious to you. Otherworldly shackles are coiled all around him, keeping him prostrate. Try to get his attention. The man raises his head with an anguished groan. Uh, don't his desperate condition offer to help him. There is nothing you can do. Save yourself. Who he is. Ask who he is. I am... I am Ahu. Oh, this is Ahu? So you've been looking for him. Well, your search is at an end. Apologies if you are expecting a more... Convivial setting. He coughs up a gout of blood. Uh. I declare you're going to find a way to save him. Before he can dissuade you any further, his eyes roll back and he loses consciousness. Alright, uh, Well, I think I found the solution. And they're tearing his soul. Give him a bunch much of snacks. Uh, yeah. The spirit ignores you. Focused as it is on tearing when he goes here? his captive, it stinks of. When you guys here too? Magic. She's fucking dead. Well, she's been dead several times. Well, delving into the numbers here. There's nothing in the spirit but pain. Its own uh -huh. and that of its captive. He resists the agony. But it's only a matter of time before the spirits tear his source away. The pain begins to hurt you too. Consume its source. The spirit seizes the pain you inflict upon it and turns it back on you. 
The pain you share nears unbearable levels, and the spirit begins to smile. This is the pinnacle of its existence. And then it exists no more. The pain it gave you ebbs away. Uh, uh, stop! I told you to leave! It, You're going to kill me! They're trying to save him. You can't. He shudders as fresh waves of pain course through him. Leave! Or you still have a chance! And don't touch the... He passes out, mid-sentence from the pain. So he he's telling me not to do this. Come over here and talk to Wendigo. Wendigo, whatever. Also, I gave you some sauce, uh, delicious. Okay. Uh, we just learned how to do better runes. We should look into that. I'll look in that in a minute. Wendigo's spirit quakes. She is no longer the arrogant banshee that summoned a kraken and brought down a magister vessel, but a fearful child bracing for parental punishment. He's close. So close. Can't you feel him, God Woken? The king approaches. <laughs> when he goes at last at her, I <laughs> super source now. Shake your head, you sense nothing. A moment of silence passes, and then Windigo's scream splits the air. He's tearing away my soul, God Woken. Cast me to the void if you must, but do not let him take me. Uh, give it to the God King's power. If he wants her, he can take her. Or how, how much? How mean do you want to be to Wendigo? Let's eh, not be too mean. Alright, okay, fine. We will summon all the sorcerers we can muster and tug at the spirit. The God King must be denied. Wendigo's spirit flutters and writhes. Your skull squeezes tight, and your throat burns with fire. But the substance of her being is nearly yours. Chant a pl plasm for ex the exorcism of demons. As ice melts before fires, so he perishes in divinity's presence. Your head shrieks as if split in two by the God King's umbrage, but you have overcome. Windigo's source funnels into you in steady gushes as you sling her spirit into the void. All right. Oh, we got it. Uh, right. Delicious. Yeah, I know. What did you give me? Just some sauce dinner. Uh, there's also an unidentified shield that you gave me. Uh, well, I mean, yeah, I've got the best shield in the game. Well, uh, I mean, uh, whatever. You can have. There's also uh, an axe, but I think that sucks too. Uh, oh, dinners. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, I just figured, like, I. It just made sense to give both to you. Alright, I'm gonna one team, one steal. Oh, she doesn't care. Oh, well, she doesn't care about any of this. Apparently, wow. Apparently none of it has anything. Notice, are you going to eat that? <laughs> apparently she is. Uh, yeah. That, that's pretty much it. There's nothing else here. Virtue token. Hey. What are virtue tokens? Oh, the consumers will bestow two source points above it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. Oh, okay. There's also the spawn breaker. I'm going to pick it up. Oh, where, where the fuck's that? Oh, there. I actually didn't notice that at all. I was talking to Arhu the whole it's time. It's not great, but it might be of some importance. Yeah, I thought, like, the Swarm Breaker was something... Good find. Yeah. We, we what does the ability do? We also have a, a half of the Swarm Breaker. That's the thing. What, what if we combine these? I'm wondering. Nope, doesn't do anything. I don't know what anything does here. So, okay, so here's the thing. There's glass here with more source points right here. And Arhu is like telling me, no, don't do this. I can continue eating the, the defilers. Well, let me try talking to Arhu. Maybe, like, what do they have to say? Uh, I mean, he just pretty much says, like, you can't do anything for me, leave. And of course, we're not going to do that. Yeah, he doesn't fucking... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try doing it all the way. I'm going to just try eating all of them. I heard him. Stop! Please stop! The pain. Oh, I'll try to get anyways. It's too much. His face goes slack as the pain renders him senseless. Ask if he can hear you. The man is oblivious to you. Also, something, something like over here. 
fucking fluctuate. All right, whatever. Okay, let's see what the hell happens in the last one. Oh, uh, who's that? It's a black ring. Oh, there's a bunch of there's black ring. Black ring. Uh huh. Could just fight this. Who cares? Let's fight him. All right. The thing is, I'm gonna drop a heal on Ahu and keep him alive. Do I do I want to do that or? Um, I, I might do that first aid. Yeah, keep him safe, I guess. All right, I'm gonna skip my turn then. Keep our guest. He doesn't seem to really care. No. Why did you be ruptured my tendons so I can't move? Okay. My tendons. Chicken tendies. No, you I think given the circumstances. I mean, I, they said keep the guest alive, though. Oh, just in case. Also, you know, we're a great fan. You oh. should. Dear Lord Ahu, you should have told me you were expecting visitors. Oh, hey, it's uh, Lord Kim. Yeah, it's... Uh, Run, you fools! <laughs> Why is he talking to you? Uh, shit, do I want to do I want to ask what the hell's going on or just tell Cam to fuck off? Tell Cam to fuck off. Tell Cam to let Ahu go. You need him, and you need him alive. Everything depends on it. That, I'm afraid, is a matter of perspective. From where I stand, all of you must die. Everything depends on it. <laughs> Why, Cam? Why betray everything for which you once stood? I stood for a lie. The God King told me the truth, so I swore an oath. He's sorry it turned out this way, of course. But you can never see Lucian. It can't be allowed. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him to put up or shut up, or who's coming with you? Oh dear. I thought you might say that. Shall we then? Sure, motherfucker, let's go. Hey, hey, good. The heal wasn't affected. Oh, he's, uh... Good thing he healed Ahu, actually. Yeah. Hey, FNC better days. Well, he was unable to move, and now he's unable to move. My tendons! Oh. Chicken tendies. Oh, God, Ahu. I need to save him. God, he's going in! How do you go? Wait, how do you see me? What the? F oh, I think maybe. I he think got something me with revealed whirlwind. you. Yeah, I think I, he got me with whirlwind, maybe. That or the phoenix that I've got. In action, oh, yeah, maybe it was yeah, a whirlwind. It is a whirlwind. I I can't tell if she's invisible because she's a fucking like bluey blo like glowy ball like of light. So All right, why don't I blind okay. everything that goes near me? Honestly. I think I'll just do a regular dude. I'll do an encourage and I'll drop a heal on Ahu. I'm just gonna stop being the shit out of this Defiler. Alright, so our target is the Defiler's first then? Well, I just, he's already wounded, so I'm just gonna give him my. Because my card is standing there, I get to pull around attack on him. Oh, fuck. I probably should have done more with my turn. Not sad. So how, much, how much armor does Kem have? Oh, hey, I'm frozen, so now my 6 AP points have gone to waste. Because I, I thought it would be a good idea to go, just go invisible and then just blow someone up on one turn, but... Thanks, thanks game! Thanks! Now you're asleep! Well, I can wake you up! Dude, it literally happened only because the fucking guy walked in, like, and, and just fucking whirlwinds in the middle randomly, dude. That's so fucking irritating, like, I, I missed my 6 AP turn. <laughs> he wasn't even in the fight when we started, when she did her, when Sibyl did her turn. Beast is frozen too? Shit. Yeah, I know. I'm fucking irritated because Sibyl uh... didn't do anything. Where's the woman that was standing next to me? Well, see, woman. Uh, where is the person that was standing next to me? I don't remember. Fuck it off somewhere. Okay, well, I think I'll delay. Unfortunately, Lord Cam appears to have deflecting, I think. Yes, he does. Ah! 
That was a weird interaction. The guy had two attacks on you. One teleported you away, and another, like, he still didn't hit you and teleported you again. They hit me twice. Oh, good. He, now he's getting my fucking source points. Okay, like, she's just stunned now. Like, the fuck? Can you unstun her? Like... I can. All, all this shit the game does sometimes, just like throws any kind of like tactics, tactics out the window. It's so fucking irritating. Unfortunately, cannot give you... Well, I can... Oh, I don't want to give my incarnate more power-ups. I kind of do. My tendons. I guess our health looking all right, except for Sabeel, but Sabeel's health is never looking all right. I mean, it's just glass cannon. What do you want? I can fortify Sabeel. And still give my incarnate something. I think I'll give my incarnate. Yeah, it's deflecting. Yeah, it's deflecting. Okay. So I'll give my incarnate power infusion. All right. And <laughs> I'll drop the fortify on Sabeel. Actually, let's, all, let's stop the from erratic risping around. Uh, maybe. I'm not sure, actually. I, I, I don't know. I don't think she needs it. They're doing, like, magical attacks for the most part. Sure. In which case, maybe I will... I'll fortify Ethan, then. So this teleport one hit with weapons or skills, so yeah, it would. Which actually brings up an interesting thing. If you if there's someone erratic wisping, you can fortify them to prevent them from moving. Alright. I can, I can probably help you out with that. You can clear mind that, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I can. I should be able before I go anywhere else. Alright, let me hit this guy. There we go. Because he's right now he's taking uh, damage from defending Lord Kim. Uh. Oh, uh, okay. So then I shouldn't, uh. I shouldn't. Maybe just kill the Defiler next to you, maybe? That's what I'm trying to do, but I was gonna actually AoE and then you maybe think that maybe I shouldn't do that. Oh, well, I, 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 I mean, know what to do. Hey! Yeah, baby! Alright, let's do some firebrand. Uh, let's see here. I don't want to hit anyone else that's kind of around here, so. Let's see. I just hit something with a fireball then. I don't know who though. Whatever you choose, try to focus him down with the stuff, because I can. Uh, oh, oh, there's the guy who fled. That's why I want to like hit in a random place. Goodbye. Oh, yeah, oh, that, that guy, okay. I'm not gonna save it for my AP. Because I don't want to do anything else because Beast is currently hostile. Yeah, I, I, by the way, I lost all my AP points that I was saving. Like, all of them. It's so annoying. <laughs> Thank you. Fuck these guys, honestly. Are you gonna ruin again. this guy's day? Yeah. I'm fucking mad. Whatever. I feel like I should go up there and finish him off, but I don't think I actually can do that. I can maybe hit him with a battle stomp. No. I'd have to go a little bit closer though. Uh Maybe just kill the guy next to you and then I can start teleporting people down. Cause that that Although, uh, goes. I was trying to stay grouped because the next time I'm definitely gonna heal. We use the like, healing ritual properly. I, I want to I want to knock this guy down though, that was the only thing. Um maybe he can actually no, that wouldn't work. What? It's because the attribute but he's a skill. He's a spell user, so it wouldn't work. Yeah. I want to knock him down. Uh I'm gonna I'm just gonna go a little bit closer. I'll be like over here. That should still be even. I don't uh, know if this will actually range. hit him, actually. 
This may not hit him. I thought it would hit him. Well, I can kind of go up here. Fuck it. Yeah, I don't care. Okay. Guess we'll go fucking hit this guy a bit. Oh, whoops. I literally set everything on fire. Uh. What damage does a dragon do? Let's see. Damage. Ah, oh, it does like 500 damage too. As much damage as I do. Oh boy. I should really invest in my summoning. The fuck? If you look at the soul bond on my continent right now. Yeah, it's uh... 160, I have 16 summoning. <laughs> I'm trying real hard, okay? This guy has... what the hell is he have? Spark Striker. Hitting enemies with melee hits will cause fiery sparks to bounce onto nearby enemies. Is that, uh, is that something I did? Or is it something... Nah, it's something he has. That's why. Shields up. I can't shield up with this, actually, because the shield doesn't have it. Oh, really? So you can't yep. get your ship back. But you have deflecting, it's all good. Oh, I have deflecting, and I have other ways to get my ship back. It's fine. Like, I will I will hit him at the end. I just want to make sure that Sibiel has uh, death resist before she starts trying to kill that guy. So. I think I'll use Hot of Steel, because I, I do need physical armor back. Alright, I have to fucking cast this, right? So that's what you And to then I will fortify myself, I guess. Yep, you have both Heart of Steel and Mending. I'm gonna get a whole shit ton of armor and then just try and break his shit. Yeah. Oh no! Yeah, good luck with that. Oh no! Healer! Oh, that, yeah, you're dead definitely now. Yeah. I did not expect a honey name. I should have been paying attention, honestly. Okay. I'll rest myself, don't worry about me. I wasn't worried. Actually, wait. wait, wait. Uh. Sorry, I was. I had my thing open. So I, have an, I have another point. I could hit someone down there, but. Nah. Go for the. Go for the high ground bonus. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna one hit uh, the guy at the bottom there, so, and he's on the ground. And if I hit Lord Kim, he has fucking uh, deflecting, so uh, I'd, deflecting, rather, you're right. I'd, I'd rather hit this guy. I'll, I'll res you with Red Prince, don't worry about it. Not can us up with uh, Beast. Okay, fine. Good. But how much armor do I have right now? 7,000, he has more. Okay. Can I get that down? Oh, I can. Alright, do I want to res myself? Actually, you said, I'll let you do it with Red Prince. Okay. Because I think I can get this guy's armor down. Oh, this will probably bounce, won't it? Because it's deflecting. No, deflecting is projectiles. Yeah, and this is a projectile. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that definitely bounced. Oh, oh you hit, you hit you like Arhu with a crit too, you fuck. Oh, I'm sorry. You've ruined everything. I have. Well, not much I can do about it now. Uh, what about my second part or anything there? Nope. We lost. Kinda did. Oh well. Blocked! Son of a bitch! Oh, miss. Alright. Hope oh, he doesn't die! <laughs> Alright. Ping where you wanna be. Uh, just... Put me, like, I don't know, fucking back here somewhere. I can't see there. I can see, like, this area kind of thing. Oh, sure. Put me, like, uh, fuck it, over here. Okay. Because you actually get to be at, like, full HP, basically. That's the other benefit to the way I do things. 
Uh, I need to heal up, so I'm gonna one of my potions. Go for it. Ow. Good thing you healed. Well, I get a king. Okay. Corner. Don't do it, Kemp. No, she just. I can see what's Ahu alive as well. Oh, Rip. She died. She's dead over there. Okay, I can get up there. Oh, I'm gonna need you to get up there. You. You fortunately will not have to heal her because uh, we want her at low health to do more damage. Because I'm gonna maybe give her a couple buffs. Okay, but how do I get up there? I can. Oh, I don't have that one on actually. Okay, looks like <clears> you can't do that. I can't get it this turn. Okay. But I can set up for it. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up. I'm gonna put my con. Oh fuck! Can't put my con up there. God damn it. This guy gets to go first. I'm gonna kill this guy with my encounter. You kinda need to put a regen on Naruto. I think he'll be fine, because I think they're actually gonna ignore him. So I'm gonna have my Iconic kill that guy, and I'm gonna put Totem. I'm gonna use my movement. Oh, I found a spot. Totem. And the next turn I can never swap my Totem. Yeah. Even if I can't do that, I can just give my incarnate warp and go up there or something. Yep, just run. Go get him. Thank God for the pawn. Holy shit. I think I kept telling you to do. Well, maybe not. I can't get up there. Oh. We lost. I'll try a sidestep. Yeah, sure. Whatever. <laughs> I just wanted to stun this guy. Yeah, the stomp will do. Me, bitch. The fuck, he's going after Red Prince. Oh. <laughs> well, that sucks because I was going to fucking use Death Resist on Sabil when she came up, but he just like walks up to him and fucking stops my shit with a crit. All right, I thanks, can... game. Get Sabil up, but the thing is, I can't hit him while fucking. What's well, fine, you can use Sabeel's turn to get yourself up, right? Because you have a... Yeah, she has a thing. But then she's gonna die because he's gonna one-hit her. Target too far. Let me just try scooting forward. Yeah, fucking, fucking get Red Prince... Get, oh, look, get Red Prince up first. Okay. If you can. And just put him, like, down here somewhere, I don't care. Uh, it's fucking annoying, actually. <laughs> but this stupid shit. I'm not sure how to do that. Let me, see, let me first see if I can get, I can, I can get up there, I can definitely get Sabeel. Okay, just get one of them, I don't, I don't give a shit. I'm just gonna run Sabeel can get the other, right? I'm gonna just run Sabeel can get Red Prince up. Yeah. Can I not swap? Why can I not swap myself? Swap yourself with a dwarf or something, I don't care. Or even the, even the, the fair maiden, I don't care, I'll fucking kill her. Okay, so why can I not teleport myself with a totem? Cannot swap selected targets. Why? Whatever. I'm just gonna walk forward. I'm gonna teleport myself. I'm gonna swap myself with my incarnate. Oh, so now you can do. That'll by, definitely do it. I'll die, but Sir I'll Kemp. do it. Hello. Oh, uh, it d actually does say he's undead, by the way, Lord Kemp. I never would have guessed. I know. It's a surprise to me too. I cannot get Red Prince, and I cannot get Sabeel? Fuck off. I mean, good thing I have spare movement. Good times. 
Alright, I'm gonna walk up here, I'm gonna die. So who would you rather I res if I res one of you? Probably Red Prince. I just put her put him beside uh Sabiel. Can't see him there, but I got just movement get, left. Get, get whoever you can see. And I, I honestly don't care because I'm just gonna use well, that I have person. Left, so as long as I can get one of you, it's fine. I get both of you. Well, I get one of you, so okay. Red Prince. Yeah, sure. King where you wanna be? Like just somewhere over here. But it's like where you pinged. Because the thing is, I'm low health anyway, so now I have to fucking deal with that. Because, uh, oh, I I can use last rites, but that's probably not a good idea because it'll kill myself. But it still may not be a bad idea because I would have to use two two scrolls anyways. I could, I could bring her back to full life, but it'll kill me. I don't know, how, how, much, how much life does it... So how much life do I Well, it just means that you're gonna get full life on Sabeel, and then have Sabeel res you. Uh, do you have two... Do, it, does it, is the last rights to... Well, is your res to AP? Uh, my res is one, uh, 3 AP. I so. guess you can't do it and something else. Yeah, one sec. I have an idea. It's piercing damage, so we're gonna kill you in either way. Well, I try my best. Alright. Well, it's fine. Now you can res yourself and get another turn. <laughs> <laughs> I need... That's stupid, by the way! <laughs> you mean legit, Also, right? meta as fuck. That's that... I mean, makes sense, but yeah, fuck you. Alright. Uh... Can I hit her, actually? No, I put myself in the corner, unfortunately. All right, one sec. I'm gonna go. Oh, tactical retreat. Actually, I will. I'm not planning on doing that. Chameleon. Uh. No, no, no. Because okay. you do go first next turn. Yeah, I know. Give me a sec. There we go. Is there any other buffs I want to give to her? Oh, she already has haste. see here. I don't think there's anything else I can really give to myself. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, that's a shame. Because I actually still have Force Vitality Exchange. So if I lowered his ar physical armor, he would uh, be able to do that. But we'll see. We'll see how this goes. Well, I mean, I'll just get into position and maybe I'll hope that I can, get, I can do it. Alright. Blood for the blood god. I have arrow spray. So, but I don't think I want to do the elemental arrows, so I'm just going to do this. <laughs> Kill yourself? Yeah. But you no, won't die. Death resist. So, yeah. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> oh, you teleported away! Alright. Oh, shit. I can't say that I saw that coming. And everybody's terrified except for Seville. Uh, right. I I did think that would happen, to be honest. Hello. No. He overpowered you. Yeah, because the Incarnate has nothing on him. All uh, right. This is awkward. Run away! Oh my! Wait, why didn't Seville get a turn? This Seville doesn't have death resist anymore. What the fuck happened? I don't under like what? We were all terrified. I guess. Thanks a lot, fucking game. Like the fuck is this stupid shit? She has this fucking. Terrified? Yeah, dude, she did. He has, she has like this fucking like two turn terrify on all of us, like AOE shit. Oh, good, dude, fucking charm too on top of that. <laughs> fucking don't game, worry. Honestly. I have the high ground. So, so erratic wisp was teleporting me all over the fucking place, so that my attack did nothing, and then fucking this shit. 
No, my legs, I need those. Please fucking bring me back to life. I'm gonna fucking- oh shit. Oh, yeah, 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 bring me back to life. Bring it. Please bring me back to life. Fuck. Because I'm gonna fucking vitality exchange that motherfucker, okay? I have a lot of things to do next You blessed time. him? Don't fuck. No! You're taunted. Beast fucked us again. <laughs> it takes your fucking point. Oh god. Oh, what the <laughs> fuck? What in the fuck? What? <laughs> what? What is going well, I'm on? I'm talking. I only talk to him. <laughs> is he just automatically buff the shit out of him? <laughs> what the fuck? How many AP points do you have for this shit? It's all my AP points. <laughs> now you're drunk. You took off your clothes and you're drunk. <laughs> Uh, alright, that's pretty glorious. Bring me back to life, you fuck. Oh, fuck, bring, I don't want to. Bring Red Prince back to life. <laughs> yeah, alright, I'll bring you back to life. Alright, that was the best fucking taunt I've ever fucking seen. <laughs> that was next level play. Oh, shit, I'm proud. Fucking Efed has 10,000 IQ. I can get Sabeel. No, I can... No, Red can Prince. Oh, Prince uh, actually... Ping, where you want to be? Right beside uh, Lord Kim. Or uh, actually, maybe not, because he's going to get a turn. Uh, maybe, maybe bring back Stabile and put her in the fucking corner somewhere. Which corner do you want to be in? Uh, some... I, I don't know, I don't really care. Just like, f far away that way or something, I don't know. Sure, I can put you like... I can put you by the altar thing over there. Yeah, yeah, Cause I'll oh, just... the altar, the, sorry, the sarcophagus. I'll just, I'll just, uh, tactical advance to Red Prince and bring him back. That's what I'm gonna do with my okay, turn. speed up. Hopefully he's not gonna do anything. So I can have a power room, by the way. I mean, go ahead. Or knock him on the ground or something. But I can't knock him on the ground and have a power room. I can either- I can have a power room get rid of all of his armor. Uh-huh. Which won't knock him down because he has enough armor to resist the damage of the attack, but not enough armor to fit, beat my armor. Oh, okay. I- I, I don't think it- Huh, oh, ah, sure. no. Better plan. How much f magic armor does he have? I can't read that. It's too uh, small. Uh, 287. 287, that might actually be too much for me. Okay, why? Okay, no, I, I do 285 to 315 on Petrifying Touch. I could try and Petrify him. Okay, go ahead. YOLO. Risky play. What the yeah. prize. No! Oh my god, it's gonna die. Wait, what? He's taunted. Oh, he's taunted. Attack the knights. But wasn't he taunted by beast? Spiel gets two turns. Do you want me to teleport? Do you want me to teleport? To no, she's no. Hmm. I mean, I I'll probably. I know the play. I know the play. But I'm gonna re I'm gonna res Red Prince. I'm telling you. Or or you could do that. I mean, either one. You know, you're wearing no clothes, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> just want to mention that. <laughs> well, I can't change that I'm drunk. <laughs> it's just your clothes come off. <laughs> hey, Beast, remember this? Do you bring Red? Can you bring Red Prince back? I can bring Red Prince back. Okay, put a put put a right beside Lord Kim. Not even joking. Just hug Lord Kim. Do you want to be up, up, the, up, up the stairs probably better, right? Because you can actually see yourself from there. Sure. Hello? Uh. Don't mind me, it's been a long day. <laughs> Alright, do you want me to do anything? Do you want me to haste you? Actually, I can't I haste. It's last turn, go figure. Uh, I, I don't know. Whatever you have. I can encourage, I can fortify. I mean, I need to get rid of this guy's armor, but I was going to do it with Sabeel. So. Cause I have no way to get rid of the armor otherwise. Okay, well then, don't, don't worry about it. I mean, if you armor Sabeel, that might be nice, but... Cause she's gonna yeah, have to Yeah, armor Sabeel, not you? Yes, armor Sabeel. But you gotta teleport. Hmm? Uh... But then she can't teleport. That's fine, I don't care. Are you sure? I, I am absolutely sure. 
Okay. There, there's a plan in motion here. And I'm not gonna encourage, because that would raise your health. <clears throat> so I guess, punching ghost. <laughs> I'm ready. Naked punching ghost. I'm ready! Alright, let's see here. Alright, time for Sibyl to do her thing. So this is actually a good experiment to see if it actually does work. Oh yeah, it does work. And I went right up to him. And he's also frozen now. The fuck? How'd this happen? I should think just cold damage and he might have been wet because that guy just cast rain. Alright, well I, I don't really need to do anything else with this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna skip my turn because I have two AP points left. Uh, we're gonna do force vitality exchange. Alright. Goodbye, Lord Kim. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, where's Demonic there? bargain? Wait, what? I mean, demonic bargain. Oh. Yes. Permanent. Doesn't do anything. Well, I don't have it on me, so that's kind of weird. Glory is mine. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> God, I love erratic well, wits. Wait, why didn't why didn't you get my turn? Oh, because I froze. Because I hit myself with that. Alright, my thing is terrified right now, but I can fix that. I'm not gonna let this bitch get away. So here's the play. Eat shit. And then eat some more shit. I'm fucking angry! Damn, not enough. Yeah, it's okay. Glory is mine. <laughs> yeah, baby. Right. Hey, Yahoo, what's good? I guess I should talk to him before we end the episode. Uh, I need. Don't mind me, he's like, I'm gonna get dressed. <laughs> oh, this guy has a shit ton of stuff. Let's go identify it. Farsight skill book, already have that. I don't even use it ever. A wand, a ring. Uh, I'm Intelligence just not high enough? No! Ken's deflector. Sets deflecting. Look, uh, there, there's also his key. I'm gonna pick up his key. Alright. Have fun. I'm gonna go talk okay, to I had something that. I that my wand was within my intelligence. Let me fuck with my wand. Much longer. I, I'm, uh, I'm talking to Arhu. It is the strangest thing. I feel restored, but a moment ago I was convinced eternal pain awaited me. Now, all the pain is gone. I'm lucky you found me. Ask him if he's really going to be okay. I will be, I think. Now that I'm out of Kem's damnable clutches, he and his black ring cronies will stop at nothing. To think I trusted a traitor. I thought him a friend. A protector of the city, yet all the while he was trying to gain entry to the crypt. To Lucian's body. Just like you, I presume. You didn't come here by chance, did you? No. Your power. Your skill. You're a god woken. You are correct. Hmm. And I think it's fair to say you didn't come to save my hide out of the kindness of your heart, either. You want to enter the tomb of Lucian, don't you? Ask him how he knows that. You are Godwoken. I was told Godwoken would want to get into the crypt. I was also told I should make sure that doesn't happen. Ask why he alone is enter able to enter the tomb. Well, what people believe about my role as the keeper of Lucian's tomb is all part of the Divine's plan. Tell him you want to know everything he knows about entering the tomb. I swore an oath to prevent anyone from ever entering the Tomb of the Divine. But that may have been a mistake. I've heard of your deeds. People call you a hero. Maybe you're worthy after all. The Divine's Tomb is a fortress. A gauntlet. No single person was entrusted with the entire sequence necessary to enter. Not even I. Lucian insisted that no one ever approach his remains, especially Godwoken. 
He said that to do so would be to surrender to the Void. He even made arrangements for agents to hunt Godwoken following his death. You may know of these agents, the White Magisters and Lone Wolf mercenaries. Uh, <clears throat> point of that Lucian's planet's failed. The Void is here and it looks like it's winning. He can't, he can't remain bound to an oath foisted upon him in bad faith. I know. Whatever way Lucian foresaw events has not come to pass. Rivalon needs a divine. I don't know every step of the path of blood, but I'll get you as far as I can. First, you must get past the statue of Lucian that judges those who approach it. There exists a source amulet and a scroll. The scroll of atonement. That will let you pass unharmed. Uh, where can we get these items? You'll need to speak to the engineer who designed this stage of the Path of Blood. A man named Sanders. He works as a toy seller now, right here in Arx. Tell him that I sent you. Alright, well, go get them and ask what happens next. Wear the amulet to charge it with source. Then bring both it and the scroll to the Path of Blood. There is a hidden mechanism. Place the amulet inside it, then read from the scroll in order to pass. Further obstacles lie beyond. I can only help with one of them. The death room. Ah. There are many levers in there. Most lead to death, but five will lead you closer to the Divine's tomb. Each lever is named after a virtue of the Divine. Five of them bear initials that spell power. Select these five and these alone. All right, where are you going to go? To my home in the cathedral. I need to recover. We have more questions before you go. Then I will answer as best as I can. I wonder why Lucian wanted to hunt down Godwoken. Did he not want his legacy to be continued by them? These are not questions you asked of the divine Godwoken. He worked in mysterious ways, and it was not our place to ask why. I hope his spirit will forgive me for breaking my oath. That's why Lucian was so determined to prevent anyone from approaching his remains. He said there was great power in them, and that the Void would seek them out. We needed to make sure no servants of the Black Ring ever laid their hands on his remains. Alright, let's go. Oh, there's a bow that's kind of... eh. He was dodging though, but no, nah, I'm not going to use that. A backstab thing. Intelligence 14 for uh, armor. And tin stockings... Strength uh, pants, that's like 142. Yeah, what are the stats on the intelligence armor? Uh, 652 magic armor and just some random mass resistances. Nah, I'm curse. Okay, I, I'm just gonna take the thing I caught that costs the most, which is ironically the the shirt. Right, anything else interesting there? Did you, get, did you find your clothes again? I found, I had to drink an intelligence potion, but I found my clothes. <laughs> he had to drink an intelligence potion. Uh, yeah, otherwise he wasn't, he wasn't smart enough. Oh, there's plenty more to do, uh, but that's for next time, so goodbye, guys. Goodbye. We will be watching. <laughs>